Have the reviews for my new game coming yet? Okay, good, good, good. <laughs> I didn't even name it. <laughs> Shit, I forgot to name it. Oh, fuck you. Ooh. That's not good. Uh. What the hell's wrong with you people? You guys like my last one? Oh no, I'm becoming the very thing I hate. The latest game by LOKK has had reviewers scratching their heads rather than bringing a new and innovative game to the market. The company delivered another fantasy RPG game, which is more or less the same setting as their previous game. One reviewer commented, I think Game 10 was simply developed too soon after the previous game, with not enough innovations in technology design. Okay, then I'll, do, then I'll make second fantasy in a couple of years from now. <sighs> You've just researched your first engine part. To be able to use this in your game, you need to create a new engine which includes this part. Okay. Um, first, let's research other things, such as... Yeah, um... Alright, let's get some open world stuff in here. Oh no, stop! Stop not being my fans! I like you people. That's awesome. I know there's, there is something like that that exists, but I've never actually played it. Will this topple the gameling? We will see. The Vinegar will debut in two months. Alright. Alright, cool. I successfully researched open world. <sighs> okay, 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 okay. Um, create a custom game engine. Let's have 2D graphics. Oh, God, this is going to break the bank. Oh, sh isn't it? That's a lot of monies. How about I create that game engine after I release my new game? How about I research a new topic first? Uh, new topic. Let's do racing. Racing was always really good back then. Stop not liking me. I'm working on it, man. I'm working on it. Stop. Good, good, good. I sold a good amount of copies still. Ah, racing. Something new and innovative. Pricks. Um... Uh, let's do Rainbow Road. Or actually, no. Rainbow Track. Racing. What kind of game would this be under? Simulation, I guess? Picking a platform for it will be the TES. Oh, wait, what? Wow. It's not a good amount of the market. Let's do for the Game Boy. Because everybody likes a game for the Game Boy. Let's have some 2D graphics. Because this game's going to look nice and neat. I don't care about the Vina. Go away. It's bulky. I don't want a bulky handheld. How am I going to be able to carry that around with me? With a Game Boy, I could just walk anywhere and use it. But with a with one of those big-ass things that can play a regular console game, I can't really do much with it. Can I put it in my pocket? No. So why am I going to carry it around? It's going to be a lot more work than it needs to be. Um, oh wow, there's a lot of bugs in this game. First objective is to make it less buggy first. And then, we release. Bada boom, new record. I did it. Maybe one day my company will be successful. No reviews for the game. Oh my god, the G64 will be taken off the market in two months. I would have been screwed if I stayed with it. Yes, new reviews. Come on, guys. Give me a good score. Thank you, kind sir. At least you were honest. I like it. Yay! This asshole's not a prick anymore. Um, okay. Okay, I see how it is. 
Yes, my first seven. Beautiful. Awesome. I totally didn't bribe that guy to say good things about my game. Not at all. I would never. I am an honest marketer. I would never bribe them. All right, time to make game engine. Let's do project cage. You guys all know my favorite game is Kingdom Hearts, so yeah, let's do project cage. Linear story. A linear story. I don't want a linear story. I gotta wait till my sales go up first. All right, good. Now I can make it. All right, let's work on Project KH. And also, guys, in the comments below, if you want to leave like a suggestion as like a game to do, I might be um. I just got. 2.5 Kingdom Hearts 2.5 and um, if you guys want to see like a let's play of it I would love to do it because it's probably one of my favorite games ever and yeah and the pretty much the idea theme of my channel so if you guys want to see like Kingdom Hearts stuff leave it in the comments and of course I'll do it because I'm gonna have no choice aren't I and also playing through the game and doing videos for it would like kill two birds with one stone, so be nice. <laughs> I'm gaining research for stuff that takes up research. All right, working on all the mechanics. This is gonna be a really good game engine. I got, I got a feeling. No way. The G64 is no longer supported. No, I, I still don't use it, so it's all good. It doesn't affect me. Now, if we were talking about, like, the Game Boy, which is, like, what I've been working on the whole time, invest over 1,000 monies in a new game. <laughs> invest over 1,000 monies. Your new game engine, Project KH, is now complete. Congratulations, your first custom game engine is now ready. You should try using it in your next game. No. Okay. Let's do it. I'm going to do K... N, because it looks like KH, but it's an N. I'd say a theme for it would be, yeah, definitely fantasy. It's definitely an RPG. Uh, no way am I having it on a console that won't do it justice. Um, well, actually, it could be Rechain of Memories, so... Rechain of Memories did, did pretty well. It's just the game... The um, mechanics were kind of not my style. Ooh, this is going to be a good game I think Rainbow Track did pretty well I'm starting to sell some pretty good games now alright let's work on all these things and make this game into an awesome game hopefully alright And I think after this game releases and hits the market, I think that's when I'll end the video. So, yeah. Awesome. Damn, that's a lot of design. That's like the highest I've ever gotten up to. What? Decrypt message? If you're interested, then transfer 36k to the enclosed uplink location. We'll th we'll contact you again, Agent Blowfish. I don't know. He doesn't seem that trustable. Sure. Evolution. Evolution. What? What? <laughs> I I don't get it. <laughs> Alright. I got a feeling this will be my next big hit. Yep. Let's do this. Alright, so this game is hopefully going to do really well. Ooh. 
It's high. Oh my god. Yes. Oh yeah. Come on. Eight. Yes. Boom boom boom. Eight. Awesome. Yep, I did great. This is this is probably the best game I've released yet. And let's check out how well it sells first. Whoa. Oh. Oh my god, I just blew the sales of every game I ever made out of the water. Oh my god, I think I've made more money from this than anything I've ever made before. 50,000 units sold. This is an important milestone in the history of LOKK. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Oh my god, it's still selling really well. Holy crap. <laughs> oh my god, that's awesome. There's a lot of fans now, too, which is really cool. Oh my god, that, that is awesome. And yeah, guys, I think I'm going to end it here for today. I think I broke a sales record, all right, and it can't get any more awesome than this. Um, well, it might. So yeah, stay tuned for next time, because I'll probably, I will most likely do more. And if you want to see more, just leave a leave a comment and like the video, please, because it really means a lot. And yeah, guys, uh, keep watching.